Today we're going to do a five minute knee strengthening workout designed to help fix your knee pain and increase your mobility. Hi, I'm Shelley and welcome to Fabulous 50s. Today's workout is all about strengthening our knees. And if you have knee problems as you're getting older, it affects your quality of life. So the way to help your knees become stronger is to work on the parts of your leg that connect the knee. So today we're going to be focusing on our hips and our thighs and our calves. And the hips and the thighs join the knee and the calves join the knee. So these are the parts of the legs that need a lot of strength. And when these parts are strong, your knees get better. So I've had lots of knee pain in the past and these exercises really help. So what I recommend is that you do this five minute workout five times a week. It's very, very doable. It's not a big challenge for you at all. And you can incorporate this into any other workout you're doing or into just before you do a walk or after you do a walk um, of a day. And it will really, really help reduce your knee pain and give you back some mobility that you may have lost as you're getting older. So let's get started. We're going to start off with some knee circles and knee circles are simple exercises to improve our flexibility in our legs and give us a great stretch. Move your knees in a circular motion, paying attention to keeping your feet flat on the floor and keep the movement in your ankles. The other side. If you're experiencing knee pain, you're not alone. Research shows that two thirds of women over 50 experience some form of knee pain. Hold onto a chair and rise up onto your toes, lifting your heels as high as possible. So with a heel raise, we're gonna strengthen our calf, which helps support the knee and continue doing this for 30 seconds. If it's going to be more manageable for you to do this on a chair, you're still going to get great results. And if you'd like to try the more advanced version, you can do this on one leg. Keep your shoulders back. Keep going, you're amazing. Lie on your back and prop yourself up on your elbows. Pull your toes towards you and clench on that muscle on the front of the thigh, locking your knees straight. Lift your leg, hold and ensure that your knee stays straight the whole time. We're doing this exercise to strengthen our quad muscles and a strong quad muscle takes all the pressure off our knee joint. And remember, if you're feeling pain, stop doing the exercise. We're going to do 30 seconds on each leg. Change legs. This isn't really hard work on your body, but doing this workout is really going to help you have more mobility and use of your legs for much, much longer. We've just got to maintain them. Whatever you can do now to strengthen your knees is going to benefit you every single year for the rest of your life. Side leg raises are really great for strengthening the hip abductors. Keep your body straight, bend the knee on the floor to a 90 degree angle, then activate the muscle on your straight leg as you bring it up. Make this movement slow and purposeful. Hold and bring back down again. Repeat this and you'll feel it opening up your hip flexors and feel your quads tightening. This is a really great exercise for our knees. Keep going, you're doing an amazing job. Change over to the other side. 
Bend the knee at 90 degrees and repeat for another 30 seconds. We're going into a knee pillow squeeze now and you're going to need a towel. I've got two towels here rolled together. Place the towel between your knees, lie on your back, arms to the side and squeeze your knees inwards towards the pillow and then release. This is an amazing exercise to strengthen the knees and it's a Pilates exercise that works the inner thighs and the pelvic floor muscles. So again, we're strengthening the muscles that connect the knees and when those muscles are strong, the pressure is taken off the knee. Continue squeezing. Make sure that you keep your back flat. We're going into the short arcs next and we'll use the same towel. So I'm using two towels rolled up together. One towel is not enough, so make sure you use two. For this exercise, we're going to be strengthening our quad muscles. Pull your toes towards you and tighten your thigh muscle. Gently lift the foot off the floor until your knee is straight. Hold for a few seconds and then slowly lower it down again. This isn't a fast exercise, so you do this one with control up and down and you can feel it in your quads. Change legs and another 30 seconds. You can feel the strength of that muscle and that's what we're doing. We're making it strong so it protects our knee. If you happen to have a foam roller, use that instead. You get a slightly better result with a foam roller, but the towel is perfect. We're going into the bridge now. So lie on your back. Fingers touching your heels and lift your bottom as high as you can without arching your back. Hold for a few seconds and then come down. Back up and squeeze the glutes the whole time. Make sure that you're not pushing from your heels or your back. All the power is going to come from your hips and your glutes. This is one of those magical exercises. It works your glutes and your hamstrings. Plus it also helps our hip mobility and strengthening our lower back. So all of those things are super important to help us maintain our mobility as we're getting older. Gently bring your body back up into a hamstring stretch. So you can either touch your toes and you can feel the stretch in the back of your hamstrings or you can keep your knees completely bent and just bend over that way. Just do what's comfortable for you and that'll be the right thing to do. You've just spent five minutes creating a better body and a body that's going to last you longer. So if you have the time, make sure you do another workout. I'll leave a playlist of five minute workouts that you can click on and just keep going. Finish off by pulling your knees in tight and try and balance for a little bit. Touch your toes to the floor if you can't balance and then try and put your toes up again. If you can do something every single day to keep your body strong and healthy, you're gonna feel so much better. Thank you so much for working out with me today. If you enjoyed the workout, please give a thumbs up and share this workout to a playlist so that you can do it often and really, really work on strengthening your knees.